research in general, right, it's an ivory tower situation. If it's not impacting people, what is the point of it? That is why I think it's so important to me to share it and to get kids involved so that they can see like research is not just this thing that's isolated and in a lab that nobody can understand, but there's like parts of research that can be applied into everyday living. And the reality of our society today is that there's not a single child that are not impacted by cancer or heart disease or diabetes. And so when we are with kids and then we're in the garden and they are getting their hands in the dirt and they're growing something and then they're getting to harvest it and then we follow up with like, oh, did you know this can help with preventing those diseases that your family member is struggling with? I've had that happen over and over again where a kid's been like, my grandmother has diabetes. Do you mean that her eating carrots could help or that her eating blueberries could help? I know how to grow that. I can contribute to her health now. That to me is like the most empowering thing that I can do is help give people back the power to take control of their own health. What is happening on this research campus is not found anywhere else in the world. You don't find eight universities working together, all focused on advancing human health understanding. So like what's happening in this campus is profound.